Gretchen. <laughs> My God, you look beautiful. You son of a bitch. I can explain. Okay, I don't want to hear it, all right? I, I just want my car back now, and I want to get as far away from you as possible. I know I said everything was fine, but this morning when I checked, I noticed that the solenoid assembly was clogged, so... Solenoid assembly. It's part of the carburetor. It draws air into the... Uh... Okay, I, I know what the carburetor is, okay, guys? And, and I know you don't need to remove the tires to unclog it. Remember all your road trips? Low tread. <laughs> I knew I risked losing your trust, right? And frankly, you can hate my guts all you want. And yeah, it hurts, but not as much as if something happened to you. I couldn't live with that. Thanks for looking out for him, man. <laughs> yeah, Nick Taylor is a renowned protector of women. <laughs> her name's Laura Wolner. She's a junior geology major. I don't really care. She lives here. That's her problem. Except for tonight. All right, I asked her for a favor. She's gonna go stay at her mom's house so that you can have a room. If you want to leave, we'll fix the car later and you're gone. But since all your old friends were gonna be here tonight, I figured you'd be up late. Might be nice to have a comfortable place to crash. God help me. <laughs> Laura's room is the first one to the left. By the time you get washed up, me and Pacey will have you a nice medium rare veggie burger with your name on it. You think you know me so well, don't you? As well as you think I can. You like imported beer, Pacey? There's an environment where nearly the whole city's your age. Beer flows like tap water, parties are ubiquitous and eternal. The whole thing's paid for by cheap long-term government loans. <laughs> This is the life. I mean, let's face it, high school sucks. Man was not created to spend seven hours a day, five days a week, crammed into a tiny desk. The whole system panders to the lowest common denominator. Standardized tests, standardized courses, standardized lunches. Exactly. And that's why anyone who isn't standard doesn't fit in. College is a fresh start. You gotta be whoever you wanna be. Why am I not surprised to see the two of you getting along? I like this guy, Gretchen. Two peas in a pod. More like two slackers in a tub. Care <laughs> to join some of the healing waters? Those wonders for the soul. My soul is just fine. It's Natchez! Over here! No offense, but I must say, all of her is fine. No offense taken. And now that you mentioned she could really use a guy like you in her life. She doesn't have a guy in her life back home? Nope. I'm telling you. Go for it, my friend. You got tough out there, huh? I have a life now. You know, I have friends, I have a job, great place by the water. Come on. You know, miss it just a little bit? This? <laughs> no way. I don't believe it. It's true. There's that thing. What thing? You know, the little thing you do when you're hiding something, you stick out your chin. I do not. Yes. You know what always drove me crazy about you, Gretchen? little line right there on your chin. It's not gonna work, Nick. What? Don't play. I'm just a sensitive boy who needs to be understood with me. I'm not gonna go upstairs to see your guitar, so don't ask. It is so good to see you guys together. Honestly, it, can you believe that this woman is still single considering what an amazing cat she is? Okay, before you try and show my teeth to prove what good breeding stock I am, you'll have to excuse me. You know, she's crazy about you, right? She talked about you the whole ride up here. I mean, it's like the two of you were meant to be together. So whatever happened? Our lives just moved in two separate directions. I think I see someone who wants to move in your direction. I don't think that'd be such a grand idea. Her name is Christy. She likes horses, water sports. And back rubs from guys just like you, buddy. You can't go wrong. Oh, but I can go wrong. There's someone back at home that would think that that's a very, very bad idea. A certain someone here? I don't think so. And I am definitely not going to say anything. Second room upstairs to the left. Condoms are in a cigar box next to the futon. I'm going to go talk to your sister. Nick. Hey, don't mention it, man. Guys like me and you, we got to look out for each other. <laughs>